Welcome to another edition of the most consistent, prolific, and dedicated uploads in YouTube history. This is Sean's View Entertainment on YouTube.com. Make sure to like this video and subscribe. And please listen to what I have to say before leaving comments. Please hear me out before leaving feedback. And please hear and take in every single thing I say to you before leaving constructive criticism or hate or death threats or what have you. Please listen to me while I try to validate my points and make them clear. So please listen to me before leaving your comments, okay? We can have a little debate. We can have a little chat. We can have a little chitter chat, whatever it is. But listen to me before you start going berserk and rioting and unsubscribing and what have you. John Cena is now a 15-time WWE champion. And the WWE is already going above and beyond the Call of Duty to make sure that fans know that he is the greatest WWE champion of all time. Now, everyone knows my stance. Everybody knows my view on John Cena. I'm one of the biggest John Cena fans there is. But just because John Cena is a 15-time WWE champion, does that make him the elite? Does that make him the greatest WWE champion in company history? Well, here's my view on things, and it might surprise you. It may come off as shocking. I, took, I put all my thoughts and I gathered up everything in my mind and my brain and I thought about it. And here's what I've come to the conclusion of for John Cena. Here's, here's what it all comes down to. There is no denying that John Cena is one of the most polarizing, resilient, determined, and one of the most demanding WWE champions of all time. Cena has one of the most hectic schedules as WWE champion and leading man in the company. John Cena is a household name. No denying that. He's a future WWE Hall of Famer, despite what the detractors and critics may say. He has main evented WrestleMania after WrestleMania after WrestleMania and has been successful in just about every single main event at WrestleMania except for a couple. Cena is a success. John Cena is just as synonymous with WWE in this era than when Hogan was synonymous with the WWF in the 80s. John Cena has had up to this point a legendary career if John Cena took his boots or his shoes and went home tomorrow he would have a Hall of Fame worthy career there's no doubt about it John Cena is one of the most recognizable names in company history John Cena has been able to stand the test of time and overcome so many obstacles and detours as a champion once again no denying that John Cena is the definition of a champion if you were to look up champion in the in the definition of a, what a champion is all about John Cena's name would probably be near the name of a champion. His picture would probably be there. Cena is arguably one of, arguably, arguably one of the greatest champions of all time. Notice how I didn't say the greatest. I said one of the greatest champions of all time. And yes, I'm getting to my point. Please just hear me out. I am getting to my point. Despite all the serious injuries and surgeries that John Cena has went through and had to deal with, he is a very lucky man to be in WWE for over 10 years on a consistent basis, performing at the level that he is. John Cena has stayed true to himself, and he has never changed despite what his detractors and haters may say. The critics will always talk about John Cena, and they will throw him under the bus at every single point. But the fact remains, John Cena has stayed true to the WWE, he has stayed true to himself. He has never backed out. He has never walked out. He has never quit on the WWE fans. Like I said, he has, he has always stayed true to himself and his fans. And he has never given up on a dream that he has had since he was a child. But to call John Cena the greatest WWE champion of all time in professional wrestling history is a little much in my view. This coming from one of the biggest John Cena fans there is. And here is a man in me who I have come on here and I have defended and I have stood up for John Cena. A man in me, and I am a man just because I'm a John Cena fan doesn't make me any less of a man, ladies and gentlemen. Even though John Cena's fan base is mostly children and girls, the fact remains John Cena cannot be denied. John Cena, ladies and gentlemen, was just like you or me. If you're a WWE fan and some fans, you know, want to grow up and become a superstar, it's their dream, it's their life, it's their goal. John Cena is just like you or I. He was a wrestling fan who just wanted to be a wrestler, who wanted to live a dream, and that's exactly what John Cena is doing. But you see, I know what 
John Cena can bring to the table. I know his toughness. I know all about his ruthless aggression. Listen, I followed Cena's career way before WWE, and that's why I'm such a supporter and such a fan of John Cena. And no matter whether he's good or bad, no, no matter the criticism, or no matter the hate, I will always be a John Cena fan because I respect what that man has done for the company. I respect what he's done for the Make-A-Wish and for all the sick children. I respect that John Cena is one of the men that has come up in not in a not so popular time in the WWE when things weren't so right and things weren't so critical. John Cena has been able to keep his head above water because he is a man of determination and satisfaction. He is a man of hustle, loyalty, and respect. John Cena is all the things he says because he, that's what he believes in because that's who he is. This isn't facade and this isn't fake. But John Cena knows himself, and you know it's not a slap in the face to, to other champions to call Cena the greatest WWE champion of all time. It's a slap in Cena's face because Cena knows himself he is not the greatest WWE champion. But I will say this. John Cena is without a doubt, in my opinion, one of the most committed, one of the most resilient, one of the most dedicated champions in WWE history, but not the greatest. And once again... It's very tough to follow in the footsteps of an Austin, a Hogan, a Flair, a Rock because of their trials and their contributions to the prof of the sport of professional wrestling. But the same could be said that when John Cena's career is all set and done and he goes off into the sunset and enjoys the rest of his life, it will be very tough to fill the shoes of what John Cena brought to the table and what he brought to the overall product and the ranking and, and the longevity and, and, and maintaining ratings. And ticket sales and buy rates and all that other stuff. It would be very tough to maintain a spot that Cena has for so long and how he did it and how he went about it. John Cena is a accomplished performer. One of the greatest WWE champions of all time, but not the greatest. That is arguable. I mean, you could make an arguable point. I'm sure someone could come on here and debate and reiterate and say all those things about how Cena is the greatest. John Cena is a good wrestler. John Cena is a great champion. John Cena is polarizing. He is defiant. He is true to his man. He is true to himself. He never backs down. He never gives up. John Cena is someone to look up to. John Cena is something to aspire to be. And John Cena has made a lot of fans cry. A lot of fans moan. A lot of people happy. A lot of people be sad, mistaken. A lot of people are positive for him. A lot of people are negative for him. John Cena gets all these reactions. And to call John Cena a failure because he gets booed. No, the guy gets a reaction. Whether good or bad, the fans are always loud. The fans are always chanting. And you're always noticing and you're always talking about John Cena. But for the WWE and Michael Cole and Seth Rollins and some fans and the WWE to call Cena the greatest WWE champion of all time, I don't know. I don't know about that one. And that's coming from one of the biggest Cena fans you'll see on YouTube.com. Now, I want your comments and your opinions on the matter. But I'll say this right now, and this is definitely a point that can't be argued. If you're going to tell me that John Cena is the worst WWE champion of all time, well, then you got some problems, and you got a problem with me because John Cena is not the worst champion of all time. Subscribe.